welcome back in this video we'll discuss about math function called calculate before we use calculate function please see the equation that I have written in the paint that out equal to 2.14 multiplied by x1 plus 3.45 multiplied by x2 and divided by 3 whole of that multiplication and addition value so how we can do that calculation in the TIA normally what we have did first we will do that multiplication then we will do the multiplication second one then add both of them and divided by 3 this one ok we will do like this first multiply first one that value 2.14 ok 2.14 and second one is x1 that is a variable the first 2.41 is a constant value x1 is a variable x2 also a variable so I will use the DB local that called conversion convert conv underscore db okay here i will return as a x1 that one is a real value okay then another input is a x2 then here i will use that i will keep the multiplication first multiplication value in one 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 variable and second multiplication value i will store in another variable then i will add those two multiplication mal1 and mal2 and keep it in as a added value add it ok now I will give a output value ok here then here it will be cnv x1 value then here I will keep the multiplication value in the variable mal1 and here I will add another multiplication function that 3.45 and here I will use CONV and second variable is X2 and keep the multiplication value in CONV mal2 then I will add those two multiplied value CONV mal1 CONV mal2 and store in the variable added ok then those added value I will I will divide it by third constant that is 3 and our dividend will be CONV here is added so our output will be CONV out so this is the our calculation of that equation that what I have did that first I have multiplied x1 by 2.41 that this is first one 2.41 multiplied by x1 and keep it as a mal, mal underscore 1 as a variable or 
स्टोर द डाटा इन दैट वेरिएबल टैग एंड हेयर सेकेंड ट्रम इज थ्री पॉइंट फोर फाइव मल्टीप्लाइड बाई एक्स टू एंड दैट हेयर आई हैव डेड थ्री पॉइंट फोर फाइव मल्टीप्लाइड बाई एक्स टू एंड स्टोर इन अंडर स्कोर माल अंडर स्कोर टू एंड आई हैव एडेड दो टू मल्टीप्लाइड वेल्यू हेयर एडेड मल्टीप्लाइड वेल्यू एंड किप्ट इन द एडेड टैग एंड lastly i have divided by 3 all those added value here this one that one is the is our calculation let's see how it is work okay here if the value x1 is 4 then our function will be output is 2.8533 okay if if the x2 value is 1 suppose it's 1 okay so what is the output output is 4.03334 okay now i will use the function our target is use the calculate function so i am taking the calculate function in network 6 okay again go to that equation here our input is 2.411 input x that is the constant input and x1 is a variable input 3.45 is a constant input x2 is a variable input and 3 is a constant variable constant input okay so here total 1 2 3 4 5 5 input so in that calculate function i have to give 5 input 1 2 3 5 so first input here is 2.14 2.14 and second input is x1 so here i already used the x1 so here i will define another x1 as a one real so x2 1 for second one okay and that is a out one okay here we will use x1 underscore 1 x2 underscore 1 for the input so here 2.4 2.14 is first constant input second is the here you can see the second one is x1 so for that calculate function i'll use the cnv that x1 underscore 1 is our second input third is a constant input 3.45 okay and fourth one is x2 so for x2 i'll use so n v that is x2 underscore 1 for in normal equation i have used x2 so for this one i have used x2 underscore 1 and for third constant input is 3 here 3 okay and i will keep the calculation value or store the calculation value in out underscore one okay so this is the input this one is our output so in between we'll write down the equation here keep in mind that you cannot use here constant value normal value here 
you have to use the all input that's why we will define 2.41 as a input 1 3.45 as a input 3 we will not write down directly that constant value so our first first term was 2.14 that 2.14 multiplied by a sorry 2.14 is our input 1 multiplied by input 2 added by that in 3 multiplied with in 4 and back it okay divided by divided by in 5 that is on that is our uh, equation now i will download it again okay now the value will be zero so here i have use x1 input as a four here I will use x1 input for and x2 input x2 input as a 1 so our output was 4.003334 so here same way I will use the input as a 4 and here I will use input as a 1 so same thing 4.003334 is our output so we don't need to use all that multiplication addition division function again and again